Hi everyone, welcome back to the ARC orientation videos. In this video, we're gonna cover Slurm, a little bit of the basics so you know how to submit a job and you can check the status of our cluster. So to get started, let's go over how do you find out what's the availability of the nodes on our cluster. In order to do that, once you're logged in, and again, I'm logged into the Newton cluster, I can type in S info. This will tell me all of the nodes and their availability. In this case, we have some nodes, um, EVC 15 through 21 are currently idle. 17 of these nodes are currently idle. We can also see the status of other nodes as they're as it's happening right now in the Newton cluster. The other thing we can do is SQ. So SQ. When we type in this command, it will show us all of the current running jobs. When I hit enter, you see all of these users currently have these jobs running for this amount of time using these nodes. So that's good because you can see the busyness or the availability of the nodes at the job level. So quickly, if we go back, S info shows us the availability of our nodes while SQ shows us what's the current job, what current jobs are running and are currently in queue. If you wanna find out your job, for example, these are all these users are running jobs right now, but let's say you wanna look for yours. Maybe the list is very large, especially if you're on the Stokes cluster, you could type in SQ space U space, and then who am I? Um, I would use the single quote that's normally on the left of the one key. So this, type in who am I, and then do that single quote again. So it should look like this, and you can enter. If you had a job there, if you're running a job, you'll be able to see your job and the status of that job there, which is great because it's a great way, especially on Stokes when you'll have a lot of jobs, you can find out what's the status of your job. If it's sitting in queue, it's currently running, if it ended, things like that. So with the S info and the SQ commands, you can find out what's the status of the nodes of on the network and the jobs that are running. In the next video, we're gonna go over how do you submit a job by using one of these S commands so you can submit it through Slurm. 